There are three reasons why they clap in the Bible. Don't clap, don't clap. The first reason is to announce war against the devil. The second reason is to announce victory over Satan. And the third reason is to welcome Jesus, the King of Kings and Lord of Lords. Come on! Put your hands together. Give the Lord a mighty praise. He's the King of all kings. He's the Lord of Lords. He's the Alpha and Omega. A for Alpha, B for Bread of Life, C for Christ, D Deliverer, E El Shaddai, F for the Father, G for God. He's the H, the High and Lifted One, the I, I Am that I Am, the J for Jesus, K for King of Kings, L for the Lord of Lords. Bless His name tonight. Hallelujah. 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 I don't know about you, but I can sense it's going to be a great convention this year. God is going to be in this place in a mighty way. The sick will be healed. People will be delivered. The hand of the Lord will be stretched. Testimonies will come forth. If you believe it, shout a mighty amen. You may be seated in the presence of the Lord. Such a great joy and privilege to be at the convention this year. And to be given the privilege of opening the convention, I'm always the forerunner for all my friends. <laughs> Praise the Lord. But I will not want to just talk about the convention. I want to celebrate our daddy and mommy for them being a blessing to the body of Christ, for being a testimony of Jesus Christ, for the honor, for the grace, for who they are, for the call of God on their life, for the grace of God on their life, for the testimony they bear, for the way they have been an example. All the years we have known them, I have known them for like 44 or 45 years, scandal free, nothing you hear that won't makes you wonder about them, only things to celebrate them. Everyone within the reach of my voice, stand on your feet, honor to whom honor is due, put your hands together and let's celebrate them this day. Come on, we celebrate you. We appreciate you. We thank God for you. We thank God for you. Amen, amen. You may be seated. You know, if you, if you know what I'm talking about, you will understand that in the few years that I've been a Christian, not many years, and in the year that I've known our daddy and mommy, the only thing I've known about them is testimonies. Only thing I've known about them is the grace of God. The only thing I've known about them is that when you think of Christianity in Nigeria and those who have made memorable impact, you think about them. When you think of people who have kept a testimony, not very easy. In a nation of over 200 million, they have a testimony which we can look at and say, these are truly fathers in ministry, mother in ministry who have challenged us. We celebrate you tonight. We appreciate you tonight. We thank God for you. We can see that Christianity is beautiful on you. So we know it will be beautiful upon us. If you agree with me, say a massive amen. amen. Praise the Lord tonight. I say praise the Lord. I have the responsibility almost for a couple of conventions now of being the forerunner. I just come and preach the ABC and those my friends, oh my God, Mensah Otterville and Tudor Bismarck. Those men are so dangerous. I'm glad I'm the first person. I'll come and preach ABC. Then they will take it to Z. When Mensah teaches you, you look at your Bible again and wonder if you are carrying the same Bible with Mensah. And when Tudor Bismarck comes, he's a man who we preach, his preaching is allegorical. He would, he would take the same story and you are looking at it and saying, read the same Bible or another one. Please celebrate the common speakers. When I saw the theme of this convention, Jesus, I said, Daddy, I've set us up. Where do you start? And where do you finish? There is a name I love to call. I love to sing its worth. It sounds like music in my soul. 
the sweetest name I know. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Oh, how I love Jesus. Because he first loved me. And I for you, Jesus. And I for you, Emmanuel. And I for you, Jesus. Jesus and our boy Emmanuel and our boy is our boy is our boy is O goni fu oru kore, o go fu kore, o go fu kore, o go fu ru kolua, o go fu kore. Hallelujah, o go fu kore, o go fu ru kolua. Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, there is something about your name, Savior, Master, Jesus, let all heaven and earth proclaim, kings and kingdoms. Pass away, but there's something about the name. What a friend we have in Jesus. Hey, our sins and grace to be Rosha, Rosha. What a free. Oh, what peace we often forfeit. Oh, what needless pain we bear. All because we do not carry. Jesus, blessed Jesus, I love that name. I love that name. Jesus, blessed Jesus, blessed Jesus, Tonight, Father, bless us in your word. Let the entrance of your word bring light to the simple. Touch our lives. Heal the sick. Set captives free. As we lift your name, let people experience your grace and your favor. In the name of Jesus. Shout a good amen. Forgive me, I gotta sing one more song. Forgive me, I gotta sing one more song before I minister. I will lift up your name higher. I, uh, I 
lift up your name. tonight one more time we ask bless us in your word in Jesus name put your hands together and bless the name of Jesus come on bless the name of Jesus glorify the name of Jesus thank God for the name of Jesus tonight I kept asking myself what else will I preach on as the opening speaker rather than to come and magnify the name of Jesus for the Bible tells us Acts of Apostles Chapter 4, verse 12. No other name given among men. By, by we may be saved by the name of Jesus. John 14, verse 6. I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man can come to the Father but by me. John, Luke 19, 10. The Son of Man is come to seek and to save that which was lost. I came tonight to let you know. Romans 10, 13. And it shall come to pass. That everyone who calls on the name of the Lord shall be saved. I didn't come for everyone tonight. I came to join the people who love to magnify the name of Jesus. I came to magnify the Savior himself. I came because the Bible says in the book of Isaiah chapter 9 and verse 6, he shall be called wonderful. My Savior is the counselor. My Savior is the prince of all peace. He is the eternal rock of ages. My God is the king of all glory. He cannot be compared to anyone. He is the mighty God. He is the king of all kings. He is the Lord of lords. I came to tell you about the Lord of hosts. He is the lily of the valley. He is our healer. He is our deliverer. He is our provider. He is the creator. The Bible says Genesis 1.1. Bereshit Barach Elohim. In the beginning, Elohim Barach. He created everything out of nothing. I came to talk to you tonight about the Porter himself who molded you. He is the day star. He is the cornerstone. He is the prophet of all prophets. He is our savior. He told Moses, Go and tell Pharaoh, I am sent you. Because if he says, I am this, he will classify him. He's bigger than one name. He is the I am that I am. Somebody slap your hand and praise him. Tonight, I didn't come to preach a sermon. I came to lift up Jesus. I came to magnify Jesus. He is the wisdom of God. He is the head of the church. He is the governor of governors. He is the righteous judge. He is the protector. He is the rock of offense against those who reject him. He is our shield. He is a merciful God. He is a gracious God. He is a faithful God. He is a giver. He is victorious. He is beautiful for holiness. He is a consuming fire. He is El Elyon, Jehovah Raphael, the God who heals. Jehovah Rohi, the God who shepherds. Jehovah Jireh, the God who provides. Jehovah El Gibor, he is Jehovah Shammah, the God who is ever present. If you run from here to Timbuktu, you will meet him there. He is Jehovah Shalom. He is El Olam, the God who is everlasting. He is our defender. When the enemy comes to fight you, he will be your defender. He is the redeemer. He is the comforter. He is Trinity in council. And the Lord said, come, let us. He was not inviting angels. He was inviting God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Ghost to create you and I. He is the instructor. He is our teacher. The inspirer. The reminder. The invisible God. The hope of glory. Lion of Judah. Or Dumunke Judah. Somebody put your hands together and bless him tonight. I came to tell you about the root of Jesse, the sustainer, the lamb of God, the man of war, the convincer, the light of the world, the restorer, 
the silencer, the stealer of stones, the proclaimer, the father of fathers, the husband of the widow. Am I preaching to you tonight? He's the smith of heaven. He's the way, the truth, the life, the bread of life. Ah, put your hands together and bless his name tonight. He's our breadwinner. He's the champion of champions. He's the winner of winners. He's the composer, the author, the finisher, the beginning, the end, the alpha, the omega, the A, the Z. Glorious in holiness, fearful in praises. No one like him. Sleepless God. Somebody put your hands together. Magnify this Jesus to now. He's the giver of life. He's the tree of life. The God who cannot change. Ancient of days. Ageless God. Eternal Jesus. Excellent Jesus. Powerful Jesus. Leader of leaders. Chief inventor. Chief convener. Compassionate Jesus. Commander in chief. Worthy king. Overseer, our molder, our shaper, our breaker, praiseworthy, helper. He's richer than the richest. He's older than the oldest. Trustworthy Jesus. He's the arranger. Would you ask you get and bless his name tonight? Somebody magnify the Lord. Magnify the Lord. Hey, hey, hey. He's the master builder. He's the master planner. He's the master minder. He's the arrester. The relentless God. The voice of hope. The beautiful God. Alpha, Omega. Game changer. Our refuge. Our fortress. Our buckler. Our banner. Our strong tower. Unchanging changer. Rose of Sharon. All in all. Pillar of our lives. He's the pillar that holds your life. Put your hands together and bless him tonight. Come on, bless his name. He's the firstborn of the resurrection. The firstborn from the dead. He's the lamb that was slain. The glorious lifter of our heads. He's the word of God. God said, let there be. Jesus was the one that was sent to make it happen. He's our advocate, our high priest, bishop of our soul, high and lofty one. Almighty God, our best friend, on time God, Lion of Judah, omnipotent, omnipresent, omniscient, consuming fire, Adonai! From everlasting to everlasting, he's still Jesus. He's the beginning, he's the end. The mystery of Jesus, he is the gift he is the giver. He is the receiver. He is the offering. He is the offerer. He is the receiver. Somebody praise him tonight. He is living waters. Omiye. Mirindu. Water that brings you life. That gives you life. Unquenchable fire. As an ex-Muslim, I have a problem. When you put my Jesus side by side with any other religion, he does not compare. You can't put him side by side. I went to seminary. They teach us something called apologetics. Defending the faith. There's nothing to defend. You don't defend a lion. Lion does not need protocol. Lion can defend itself. The lion of Judah will defend himself. Am I preaching to somebody tonight? If you believe it, shout yes. Tonight I came to salute His Excellency. 
He's awesome God, battle stopper, unquestionable God, Jehovah Sidkenu, mighty in battle, glorious in holiness, fearful in praises, mighty man of valor, miracle walker, rock of ages, merciful God, advocate, doing wonders, is the amen and the hallelujah, is the answer to prayer, is our intercessor, ever living, standing between us and God arguing your case before the father is the interceptor when the enemy shoots the weapons he intercepts and he destroys their weapon is the bomb of Gilead somebody will be healed tonight someone will be set free tonight and if you ask me why do you magnify Jesus I magnify Jesus because he's the reason for living Philippians 1:21. For me to live is Christ and to die is gain. He's the fulfillment of the promise to deliver. He's the author of my salvation. Come on, somebody praise him. He's the prince of all peace. He's the omniscient God. He knows all things. He's omnipresent. He's here. He's in London. He's in Australia. He's in Germany. He's in America. It's in the South Pole. It's in the North Pole. Even hell, he poured his anger there so that they will feel his presence. He is the counselor. He is the controller. He is the one who turns your weeping into joy. Come on, put your hands together and bless him tonight. Magnify him tonight. He is our refuge. He is gracious, committed to you. He's our source of guidance. He's always the same. Hebrews 13, 8. Jesus Christ the same. Yesterday and today and forever. Malachi 3, 6. Behold, I am God. I do not change. He is Jesus. He is Savior. He is Christ. Christos, the anointed one and his anointed. He's our Savior. He's the promised one. He's a name above all names. Every name bows to him. The Bible says, every knee shall bow and every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. The day is coming. Ayatollah Khomeini will bow. Muhammad Gaddafi will bow. Sickness will bow. Challenges will bow. Battles of life will bow. Come on, if you agree, put hands together and bless the Lord. He's the one with glory greater than glory. Ogbe ogo, kari ogo. Tonight, I want you to know, you need to know how to magnify him because he's the anointed one. He's the holy one. The fulfillment of promise. We live in a nation where somebody's trying to force another religion down our throat. First of all, Christianity is not a religion because in religion, man is trying to reach God. When Christianity, God is reaching down to man. For God so loved the world that he gave. We are not the givers. He gave us. Come on, somebody praise him tonight. Bless him tonight. Bless him tonight. Even if it's only five people who join me in celebrating Jesus tonight, it's enough for me. He's the fulfillment of all promises. He's, the, he's Joshua's mighty warrior. Dress for battle. Hey, hey, hey. Even before the fullness of time, he showed his face many times. Joshua saw one man near Jericho. He said, ah, who be this man? His sword is too long. His stature is so heavy. He went to him, are you with us or against us? He said, I am the commander of heaven. <laughs> Jesus before the fullness of time. Every time he showed in the Old Testament, before the fullness of time, he was to bless. I prophesy on you during this convention, he will show up and bless you. He will show up and change your life. Your story will change. I said your story will change. Who am I talking about tonight? 
Joshua's commander is the one I talk about tonight. He is Moses' rod. The stick in the hand of Moses was a stick until Jesus took over. Exodus chapter 4 verse 20. And Moses took the rod of God. Not the rod of Moses anymore. And Moses took the rod of God. That rod that parted the sea will walk in your life. That rod that parted the sea will rock walk in your life. The rod that brought forth water out of the rocks will walk in your life. He will give you a testimony. He is Daniel's angel that came into the lion's den and sealed the mouth of the lions. Tonight I prophesy he will show up in your life. He will show up in your life. He's the fourth man in the fiery furnace. Nebuchadnezzar said, didn't we throw three men in the fire? But I see four men. And the fourth man, he looks like the son of God. But he doesn't just look like the son of God. In the words of Ed, El, Elvis Presley, he looks like an angel. He walks like an angel. It is Jesus himself. I pray for somebody here. You are in the fire, he will show up for you. You are in the battle, he will show up for you. You are going through tough time, he will show up for you. I declare and decree, if you can say amen, it's for you. Ah! Nigeria will see your Jesus. They will see him at work in your life. He will open uncommon doors. He will announce you. 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 If you believe, shout a good amen. I came tonight to magnify Jesus, the shepherd of Israel. I came tonight to magnify Jesus, the stone in the hand of David. Five stones, but the number one stone brought down Goliath. It wasn't just a stone. It was the stone of all stones. Because when the stone hit Goliath, he fell forward. If truly it was the stone of David, he should have fallen back by the thrust and the velocity. He should have fallen back. But by falling forward, another stone brought Goliath down. They don't know, say, you get another stone. No. And that stone is J-E-S-U-S. From tonight, as you launch that stone, victory will come to your house. Testimony will come to your house. Glory will come to your house. Shout amen with fire. Shout amen with power. I came to magnify Jesus. He's the unchanging changer. My king was born a king. My king is a king several ways. He's the king of the Jews. He's the king of Israel. He's a king of righteousness. He's a king of ages. He's a king of heaven. He's a king of glory. And above all, he's a king of kings. Every knee bows to him. If you don't know my king, I present him to you tonight. He will work in your life. Shout, I receive it. Say it again, I receive it. I don't know who I'm preaching to tonight, but I talk to you about Jesus. No barrier will stop him in your life. No limitation will stop him in your life. He shall be enduringly strong in your life. He shall be entirely strong in your life. He'll be eternally steadfast in your life. Come on, put your hands together and give God a praise tonight. Bless his name. Bless his name. Who is this Jesus? Who is this Jesus? He is immortally graceful. Imperially powerful. He is impartial impartially merciful he is the God's son he is the sinner's savior he is the centerpiece of civilization 2023 is numbered after his resurrection tonight I will present to you he is honest he is unique he is alone by himself he is unparalleled you can't put Jesus by anyone he is unprecedented he is supreme. He is preeminent. He is above everything else. He was there at creation. He saw you when you were folded and put in your mother's womb. He's working in your life. 
he's going to work more in your life Jesus is the grandest idea in literature he's the highest personality in philosophy he's the supreme problem solver in every place he's the fundamental doctrine of the Bible no Jesus no Bible from Genesis to Revelation he's the reason for the book is there in every book in Genesis is there as the son of the woman in Exodus is the lamb that was slain everywhere you turn in this book he's there put put your hands together and really magnify him. magnify him magnify him Jesus is the miracle of the age people cannot fit they can't explain him he's messing their head up he is the superlative of everything good he is the only one able to supply all our needs simultaneously whether you are in Africa or in Asia and I pray for you your need will be supplied he gives strength to the weak receive in the name of Jesus he's available for the tempted and the tried receive in the name of Jesus he sympathizes and he saves receive in the name of Jesus he's the almighty who guides people he will guide you in Jesus name he's the one who heals the sick am I talking to you tonight I want you to know that Jesus he's the forgiver of sins he's the cleanser of lepers the discharger of debtors the deliverer of the captives the defender of the feeble he blesses the young he serves the unfortunate he regards the agent he rewards the diligent he's the king of all kings king of knowledge wellspring of wisdom doorway of deliverance pathway of peace roadway of righteousness highway of holiness can I ask you to put your hands together and magnify the Lord magnify him magnify he's the master of the mighty he's the gateway of glory he's the captain of the conquerors he's the head of the heroes he's the head of the legislatures he's the overseer of overcomers if you are one of them give God praise he's the governor of governors he's the prince of princes the king of kings lord of lords he is my king his office is manifold his promise is sure his light is matchless his goodness is limitless his mercy is everlasting his love never changes his word is enough his grace is sufficient he reigns in righteousness every day over our lives no weapon formed against you will prosper every mouth that rises against you in judgment shall be condemned days in your life when you don't know how to pray just call his name you don't even know what to say just sit in your prayer place and say Jesus Jesus Allah calling your name sweet rose of shine Jesus Jesus Every day, every day, your name is the same. When you call that name, heaven will hear you. There is a name I love to call, the name of Jesus. When you call that name, angels draw their sword. Why? Because he's indescribable. He reigns supreme. His yoke is easy, his burden is light. He is incomprehensible. You can't put him side by side with anything. He is invincible and irresistible. Invincible, irresistible. Heaven cannot contain him. When you point and say heaven, you may be pointing at China. It's bigger than one location. It's greater than one location. It's heavier than one location. You can't get him out of your mind. And you can't get him out of your hands. You can't outlive him. The Pharisees could not understand him. Pilate could not find a fault in him. The witnesses came. 
they didn't know what to say about him. Herod could not kill him. Death could not handle him. And the grave could not keep him. The grave could not keep him. Up from the grave, he arose with a mighty shout over his voice. He arose. He has no predecessor and no one will be after him. He's the beginning. He's the end. He's co-equal with God and the Holy Ghost. Co-eternal, co-existent, and co-equal. If anybody saying, this is your trinity. How can three people be the same level? They are co-eternal, co-existent, co-equal. Co-eternal, co-existent, co-equal. There's nobody before him. And there'll be nobody after him. They cannot impeach him. And he will not resign. That's my king of kings. That's my lord of lords. Thine is the glory. <laughs> Reason lord of lords. All glory belongs to him. People are talking about black power, white power. His power is bigger than color. All glory belongs to him. Ah! His glory cannot be compared. It cannot be measured. His glory is forever. His kingdom is forever. His kingdom shall reign forever. Put your hands together. Bless his name. Come and celebrate Jesus. Celebrate Jesus. Magnify Jesus. Magnify Jesus. And tonight, I'm about to prophesy into your life that because of the name of Jesus, these things are going to come to pass in your life. I like your amen to sound like fire and thunder. Because of the name of Jesus, your enemies will be scattered. Because of the name of Jesus, the earth will tremble for your God. The sea will see him and flee. Mountains and hills will quake before your God. You have called on the name of Jesus. Because of you, the sun, the moon, the sea, and the stars will stand still. Nations and kingdoms will bow before your God. The horse and the rider that have been chasing you will be thrown into the sea. Because of the name of Jesus, heaven will send rain to your farm. Heaven will send blessing to your life. Terror and gripping fear will hold your enemies. Confusion and commotion will fall into the camp of your enemies. Because of the name of Jesus, Beauty will replace your ashes. Joy will replace your mourning. Your earth will yield her increase. I came to announce to somebody here, because of the name of Jesus, you are coming out of prison. You are coming out of financial prison. You are coming out of mental prison. You are coming out of physical prison. Because of the name of Jesus, chains are falling off you. Shackles are falling off you. You will no longer be a victim. You will be a victor. Because of the name of Jesus, you will conquer. You will conquer. Because of the name of Jesus, the impossible will become possibilities. The impossible will become your possibilities. Because of the name of Jesus, you're irreversible. The doctor told you, sorry, no one has been cured from this disease. Tonight we call on the name of Jesus. You are coming out of that cancer. 
You're coming out of that diabetes. You're coming out of that liver problem. You're coming out of high blood pressure. You are healed from tonight. The Lord Jesus sets you free. Shout amen with power. Tonight, because of the name of Jesus in your life, every hungry lion that I've been pursuing you, God silences them. The fiery furnace they prepared for you, the enemy will end inside it. Every Pharaoh, every Pharaoh that have pursued you and pursued you, you moved, they still followed you, they will die in their own Red Sea. They will die in their own Red Sea. Because of the name of Jesus, I prophesy on somebody, 2024, your desert will become a land of streams, a land of favor, a land of blessing, a land of favor, a land of glory. Because of the name of Jesus, your desert will blossom with roses. The Bible says the rock gave water when he pointed at the rock with that rod in his hand. We point at the rock of your life. We command water to begin to gush out. Water of life to begin to gush out. 2024 will be your year of testimony. When others are complaining, you will be celebrating. Shout amen three times with fire. Because of the name of Jesus, I speak into somebody's life, particularly businessmen and women in this house. You will break new grounds. 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 Break new grounds. Receive breakthrough visitation. Been a Christian a few years, 51 years now. I've been born again. Got born again when I was 20. It's a Muslim boy whose name was Ahmed. I have seen God visit people and sudden promotion. Somebody's here tonight because of the name of Jesus. The promotion no man can give you, the elevation no man can give you. Receive in the name of Jesus. Receive in the name of Jesus. Receive in the name of Jesus. Because of the name of Jesus, there are strange helps. Hector Jimenez was a preacher in Argentina. He waited on the Lord for six months. He wants to start a church. At the end of the six months, he decides to go for a walk late night. He was, he was precisely in front of a radio station at 11.45. They opened the door of the radio station and they said, Hey, sir, who is passing by? Hey, sir, hey, sir, sir, this radio station has 15 minutes. We don't know what to do with it. Can you come and talk to Argentina? Ah, a man who has been fasting for six months. The guy has already become ish. He's a living fire. When he finished 15 minutes, the same guy said, can you come back tomorrow? And tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow. <laughs> At the end of six months, the day he opened his church, they ran four services. <laughs> Hector Jimenez's church reached the point of 10 services. In fact, they reached the place where they'll tell you, hey, you, you are a Tuesday Christian. Don't come on Monday. How many pastors will like that kind of problem? Too much crowd. Tonight, by the name that is above all names, receive on common breakthrough. 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 Shout amen with fire. Because of the name of Jesus, help us will rise for you. A young man called me, said I was sustained 
in university by your TV program while I was in Joss. I was a poor boy. I was always eating from my friend's house. Now it's 5% owner of share. 5%. No, be small thing. No. Hey, you own 5% of share. All game. So he calls me. I said, oh, I want to sow into your crusade. And he gave some money. Then he tells me a story. He has his own jet. He lives in Dubai. Comes here and goes back. He said, one time I came. And you know, Niger, even if you live anywhere, you still won't chop something within the chop here. Because he went in the roast corn. Come back. He won't buy corn. Now he can see the woman say, her daughter know they go to school. He said, why your daughter no go to school now? Mama say, ah. I saw no this corn I would take leave. The school fee where they tell me the girl come pay. I don't get her. He said, How much is the school fee? And the girl is in GSS two or so. He said, from today to master's degree. The girl will be my responsibility. Somebody here tonight, the name of Jesus will open on common doors for you. Help will rise for you will rise for you delay will disappear this favor will live your life shout amen with fire people will show you favor promotion will overtake you promotion will overwhelm you promotion will overtake you promotion will overwhelm you promotion will overtake you promotion will overwhelm you Opposition will give way for your God. Your steps will lead to success. Your hand will be blessed with the blessing of God. Somebody here. As you celebrate this name, your name will be circulated in the right places. Your name will be circulated in the right places. Shout amen with fire. From tonight, stumbling blocks are removed from your journey. Somebody is in this service. <laughs> you are in this service. You are in this service. I prophesy on your life. Yours is going to be such an accelerated thing. You will become a reference point. You will become a reference point. You will become a reference point. If you believe it, shout, I receive it. You will recover your favor. I said you will recover your favor. Doors of help will open for you. Your testimony will be heard around the world. Your story will change. The name of Jesus will work for you. Stand on your feet, put your hands together and begin to give God a clap of praise. Give God a praise. Give God a praise. Magnify. Magnify the Lord. Who oh, bless his name. Who oh, bless his name. I am shot. As you bless the Lord, receive your healing, receive your deliverance, receive your favor, receive your breakthrough, receive your change, receive your turnaround. prayer and I believe he's making me say it here somebody here before Christmas day a testimony that gives testimony will break out in your life 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 will break out in your life. 
we break out in your life. We break out in your life. We break out in your life. In Jesus' name. You have stepped into this hall. I know you've come many times. But this year's convention will be a strange one. For some strange reason, Daddy gave us the name of the Lord as the team. Ah, you shall have unforgettable testimony. Unforgettable breakthrough will visit your house. So shall it be. Somebody magnify the Lord for me. Come on, give God praise. Magnify him. Magnify the Lord. Exalt the Lord. Lift him up. Lift him up. Lift him up. Ah! Lift him up. Lift him up. Bless the name of Jesus. Little Rosha. Ayana Rimanote. Iria Lara Rosa. Candy Lira. Lishka Lero. Rano Seca. Riketa Lerevo. Janine Raba. Thank you, Jesus. Precious name. Oh, how sweet. Hope of earth and joy of heaven. Precious name. Oh, how sweet. Hope of earth. Joy of heaven. Take the name of Jesus with me, child of sorrow and of woe. It will joy and comfort give you. Take it everywhere you go. Precious name. Oh, how sweet. Hope of earth and joy of heaven. Precious name, oh how sweet, oh for earth and joy of From tonight, something awesome has just begun in your life. You will testify in the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus. Put your hands together and bless the Lord. Come on. Give God a praise. Give God a praise. Give God a praise.